Hey there, I'm your former neighborhood gaming play gamer HD, and today I'm back on Gamer Simpsons channel with Free Game Friday, the series that makes me look cheap. Today we're playing the free game Fingerbones, which is a psychological horror game by David Sazamensky. Fingerbones is intended to be completed in the single sitting and there is no save function. It's suggested that you set it aside, blah blah blah, to exit. Okay, so we're in a world that is extremely bright. This is the. Yes, that's the exit. Ooh, a door, I think. Yes, it's a door. A panel. Okay. I can't see shat. What is that? Oh, okay. We just decided to make the life a lot harder. And we can't hear ourselves breathe. Ooh, what's this? Is it a knife? Ooh, what is this? A map? No. It's my weekend to get. It's my weekend to get. I'm really not in the mood. I distracted her with the TV and came here to read. Came here to read. I couldn't interest myself in reading, so I tried to write. I couldn't write anything more than the usual handful of disconnected thoughts and theories. Medication didn't help, and divorce certainly didn't help. Because I am not depressed, I am enlightened. This is in the result of decades of scientific education and philosophical, philosophical pondering in this pure science, science of knowledge. The price of knowledge. Okay, sorry, I wasn't making that joke. There's a shelf. With a thing on the side, can I pick that up? It's like, no. When I was 15 years, I lost my virginity. Okay, that, that came out of nowhere. Shook uncontrollably the entire time. I felt like my primal excitement yesterday night in the I felt that same primal excitement yesterday night in the cellar. Jeez Louise, I'm stuttering so much today. I have some sort of mental illness. Not really. What is this? Bill? Clinton! That's not how you saw Bill Clinton. Bill. Clinton. Okay. Don't know what that is. And yes, there is. It appears to be a page from a manuscript. Partner. I don't want to read a manuscript. Fuck off. There's this thing. It's, it emits light. Is that a plus? There's a box in the corner. I don't know why I'd use my daughter's name as a door lock code in my survival bunker, but whatever keeps her happy. I suppose she's like a mother, a delicate, fragile version of a mother. Damn her. Let's go to the moon! Wait, so the only other door in here is either this latch thing or the door of that. So I think that accessing this keyboard, easy. And typing. What was the name, Katie? Okay, yeah, it worked. I think it had to have worked. I mean, uh, how, why else would it have worked? To the moon! Okay, so we're going down. Oh, I'm flying. Flying, I'm magic. Okay, no, I'm not. Oh, I'm terrified. What's gonna be down here? Something bad's gonna be down here. Okay, what's this? It's finally happened. The whole world is in chaos of thunder, post apocalyptic, and screams, and when the ashes settle with the wild animals, we get a guess. Basically, I haven't been able to reach Lynn for several days. Oh, scary, eerie noises. I think Lynn might be her mother. For several days, and she's probably dead for all I know or care, but Katie was here when it started, and I have no idea what to do with her. Most of the town is dead. Katie and I only survived because of the rent of the bunker. Perhaps this is what I've needed. Freedom from all the irritation, the irrational rules, and inane social values. Just pure, beautiful survival. Okay, so... Open that door and all that door. So I guess we're gonna have to use that thing again. I boxed up everything that isn't practical and useful. I burned all the books that weren't for scientific or ed 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 edification. I'd like to store the books in the cellar, but I can't get them down the ladder by myself. Just pile them up near the hatch. Blood would probably ruin them anyway. Wow. Oh, oh there's something back here too. No, 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 I can't reach it. God damn it. The tool room has been her name for years now. I can't bring myself to change it. Okay, so I can't access these. I guess we're gonna have to go back to the magic uh, keyboard that connects to the wall. And uh, yeah, just. We're going to need to type up. Was it Lin or Jin? It was Lin. Lin. Okay, it opened the door. And right, what's in here? Hello? Room cleaning. I'm sorry if I wanted room cleaning. I've got goosebumps down. I am going to saw you to death. Okay. Ooh. 
There are things I've wanted to do for years, desires I've kept locked in the back of my consciousness. It's been nearly a year since I've seen a woman, and now I realize there's no practical reason to keep these desires locked. Oh my god. Okay, I'm going to put the pieces together. He lost his virginity 15. Wrote that down. But the game dev made sure we found that. And, um... Primordial desires locked up at the back of his head. His daughter is somewhat assumed to be locked up or dead. I reckon she's locked up, and he wants to have sex with her. Yep, that, that's it. She remembered Father Sandra me a picture. I don't understand her. She's just like a mother. She wants to waste time drawing pictures, and we're barely able to find enough food to survive. I turned to crowns at the candles. What a harsh, harsh man. We need more candles in case the generator goes out again. That's a smart idea, actually. We need more candles in case the generator goes out again and helps break up the monotony. I am getting eaten. My butt just got tickled. I went for the excitement of those first few weeks. Okay, what's over here? Oh, a door. I bet you there's a code I have to enter. Yep. <coughs> okay, what's over here? It's a note. I changed the storage room code to something I can easily remember, and, and the rest of the word is missing. Yeah, I'm crying too. I can't fucking access the door. I can still move around, even though I'm stuck in this thing. Really, Ninja? What? NNYL? What? What's that? NNYL? Oh no. Um. Okay. Can I close the door, please? Let me close it. No, fuck off. I'm a bag of DNA and I exist to make more of myself. I married and produced a daughter because my genes demand reproduction. I wrote books and created because creativity served a survival advantage to my ancient ape ancestors. I built this place. Took refuge in it and spent hours thinking up silly little artificial laws to live by because my forefathers built cities and societies to allow time and peace to reproduce and protect their genes. Dreams, loves, opinions, desires, beauties, innocence, figments of our collective primordial imagination, fleeting electrical signals that fire across our synapse, synapses for a pointless moment for, in time. They used to serve a purpose, and now they are needless F confusion. And here I am, the last man on earth, for all I know, ready to be f freed from them. Okay, I'm going to assume, because it was in brackets, DNA is the key lock, uh, the key code. No, oh, to be completely honest, what? Instinct. Oh my god, my spelling. Instinct. Uh, ape. Oh, for fuck's sake. Um, that's the only clue I'm, I'm allowed of. How am I at all allowed to... How am I at all supposed to figure this out? It might be freedom. Lamal, last man on earth. Laugh my ass off. Huh. It's actually quite close. Lamoya? I'll type up Lamal and Lamo. And desires and innocence and all that shit. Lamal. No. Nope. Lamo. No. Freedom. Oh! I got it. I can't believe it. I feel so accomplished. I was just saying previously, if I don't know if I edited it out or not. Can you guys share this video? Like, I got two views on the last one. Guys, I am getting terrified. Um, 
I don't want to sit here and just record and upload it to YouTube and no one watch it. I will get. What the fuck? There's only enough food for one, so, so she's going to die anyway. I am free now. Freedom. It took the end of all humanity for me to. F what the fuck? Music, stop picking up. Stop. 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 What the fuck? What the fuck? What's going on? It seems to have been torn from a diary. She finally died last night. I don't know whether from starvation, dehydration, or blood loss. I threw her body into the woods. Her fingers, my anti-religious artifacts, my testaments to moral, intellectual freedom are locked in the safe upstairs. I am content in the knowledge that I haven't done anything wrong. The father didn't know why he'd come back after all these years, starving and tired. He just wanted to see the cellar one, lo one last time. With one last flicker, the flashlight died and he was left in the pitch dark. He sat down on the cold floor and closed his eyes. He could still hear her, even now. It was peaceful here in the cellar. It was free in the cellar. Anyway, um, guys, if you can share this video, share the previous video if possible. Leave a like, comment. Um, that, that was absolutely terrifying. I was expecting the girl to launch out at me and claw my eyes out. I truly was. Back on the happy note. Um, if you guys can leave a comment below, tell me what free game I will play next. I will play that game. Leave a, sh a shout out to you. And yeah, by the way, I, I don't know if you've heard this, but in my intro, I've said my name is Gaming HT. I'm not necessarily solo gamers instance. Yes, I do have my own solo channel that I do upload my other stuff on. Um, if you guys want to check that out then it might entice you to leave a comment so then I might give you a shout out on both channels when I'm doing the trailer for Free Game Friday. Friday. So yeah, that, that's a little heads up. But see you bye, au revoir, whatever you say, Gaming HT, out. And remember, I'm not cheap, it's the games.